Well, good morning. Good morning. Uh, I guess I'll give this another try. Okay. Another try. What the world we're talking about. Yeah. Well, I thought I'd listen to Ryan's video again and him addressing me. Uh, we did have a discussion and a little bit of discussion in a live chat uh, a couple days ago. And uh, let me see here. Yeah, grab my smokes. Um, I guess the idea was that you know we could talk about it uh, privately, and I, and I have nothing against talking privately in certain situations. Uh, I, I think it certainly has its place, but I, I, I guess you know for me, I, I I don't see YouTube as church, although to some people it may be. Uh, you know, I can gather and. Uh, worship together somehow. Okay, well, YouTube is not church, according to you. Then you should go to church. You know, you know on YouTube and share and such. I, I get that, but I, I really don't see it as church, it, it, particularly in the sense that uh, you have all kinds of people watching your videos if you're making it live. You know, and uh, kind of sad because, like, when I see you, Bruce. I mean, you got a lovely wife. I mean, you could go to church with her hand in hand, but you decide not to, you know. For me, you know, I, I don't even have a wife to go hand in hand. You know what I'm saying? Uh, well, some people, well, most of us, while people participate in such and So it's not church. It is public. That's, that's really my main point. It is public. And when talking about other people in public, I believe it should be addressed publicly, and certainly, uh, if not that it should be, it's, you certainly have a right. Well, what do you think a church is? Church is also public within the private setting, likewise YouTube. To address it publicly when it was presented to you and others publicly. If it is presented within the church, then it should be presented within the church. If it is going to be something about YouTube, that it's going to be on YouTube. Whether you pri uh, follow what Christ said privately or not privately, it's up to you. Whether you're online or offline, whether that's YouTube or not, that's up to you to follow what Christ said. You know? And I have to come back to the thing where somebody makes a nasty comment about somebody. Really, really nasty. And then uh, you get this idea of... Uh, well, you know, you should come to me. You should come to me if you have an issue with that. Uh, well, you know, then you shouldn't share it publicly. Well, if it is something shared publicly, then why, why can't you come publicly? <laughs> I mean, this is why you cannot ever get an answer. You cannot come. Uh, you cannot come at all, whether it's privately or publicly. You cannot come at all because your deeds will be reproved. You know what I mean? You know, and if you don't want other people looking at it, then, then honestly, uh, keep it to yourself. Or Likewise, if you don't want me to comment to your stupidity, well, keep it to yourself, man. Talk with others privately about it. If you're going to put it on the public, and don't get you all follow your own, own advice, bro. notice what you said. Publicly. Of course. Of course. I don't understand. It's like, I mean, I mean, kind of like if you, if you walk around your house. If something is mentioned publicly, then obviously you're going to have to deal with it publicly. Like, for example, how you and Rob blur out saying that I'm some kind of pornographer publicly, you know? So when that kind of things happen, then I'll address it publicly, saying that you are a liar. Don't go crying boo-boo, man. Boo-hoo, man. That's what a sign that says I'm an idiot. Well, maybe you know it when you look in a mirror, you know, or whatever. Uh, when you know, it's not like you're walking around outside. If you wear the same sign outside, and people laugh at you and make fun of you about it, want to talk about it, you shouldn't be upset, you know. Likewise, you know, you shouldn't be upset. You're the most sensitive guy ever on YouTube. Just because someone suggests something, for example, you go all upset. Oh, you're not supposed to tell me what to do. Blah blah blah. You know, you're such a control freak, man. You are an idiot at that point, I guess. No, you are. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this idiot. He was public. I think I... Look at this idiot. He thinks that he he's the only one with a voice. <laughs> <laughs> so you're on public, so I'll make it, you know, publicly. You know, my so-called uh, couple of cents, man. You got issue with it? 
pretty well explained that. I think if you want to disagree with it, uh, feel free to provide uh, which I'm doing and such, uh, make a video, whatever, explaining why which I'm YouTube doing. is actually not public. Who, who's ever said YouTube is not public? <laughs> According to the scripture, what Christ said is that if you want to gain a brother, you are supposed to take a matter to him directly, privately. All right. Let's say if there's some kind of matter on YouTube, and uh, you take that matter to that person, not directly physically, but online, right, on YouTube, privately. Okay, that's how it's done, privately and directly. Just because something is public, for example, doesn't mean that you're going to be all public about it. And you're going to lose your brother. So, again, if you want to gain a brother, you do so privately, not publicly. And you do know the difference between public and private, right, Bruce? Like in Hangouts, there is online and offline. Did you understand? Okay, I'll be waiting for that. And that includes in the comment sections. I mean, like, one must be so dumb like this, man. He thinks that, you know, just because he has mouse, others shouldn't. <laughs> you know, what's public is public, man. You want to take certain matter that is not even public? Take it up with, uh, you know, with that person directly. Why is that so hard? Is that public? Yet you want to do it public? Take it, you know, take it public, man. What's so hard? You know, it's not just because something is public doesn't mean that it's, you know, you can do so publicly. See, if you are not a Christian, obviously you will not do so. But according to Christ, that's what we are supposed to do. If you have any matter uh, among brethren, you have to take that privately. Simple as that, privately and directly, man. Doesn't matter how much you say that it's pri public, therefore it's uh, public. Well, I'm just using your logic. Okay, so you want to be public? Let's be public. Nobody else can read my view. No, I mean, when let's say a subscriber is talking to the uploader, that's between them, not your business. That's the, that's all. You know, if you put your nose, we call that you put in your nose, and you may say that oh, it's public. In within public. You are not supposed to be in certain status. Like, for example, you are not supposed to, like, reveal yourself. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Even in public. Public doesn't mean that you get to do whatever you want. Public kind of means that you think about other person. Did you understand that, Bruce? And a few others, it, uh, it's of their business and certainly nobody else. Okay, so enough of that. Of right. course, it's certainly none of others' business. It's just, just none of your business, none of my business. Now, if you want to make that your business, it's very simple. You know, engage publicly, neutrally. You want to know both parts, right? You are so nosy and you are so drama loving and you want to address it publicly. You should know the both part, right? So that you could actually assess it fairly. See, what you've been doing is that you cannot even call out your own subscribers. You know, like Dwayne Disco. You know, he actually forwards MessianicTruthLive.com to porn sites. And, you know, of course there's no evidence. Of course he doesn't say, yes, I did it. But you can actually know what he did by actually asking him if he, can, if he did it or not. This guy cannot even answer if he did it or not. You know, I mean, if he didn't, he should obviously say that he did it. But the fact that he cannot even answer it kind of tells me a lot of things. This pawn crap named DV Disco is forwarding this domain to actual pawn website. You cannot even call that out. Likewise, you cannot call out Robbie, who actually false flagged my videos, you know, for fair use videos, man. That kind of things. Okay, that's why you know, that's why people laugh at you, man. <laughs> like that. Me publicly. I mean, like they will laugh at you. And look at look at your face, man. Look at you, and they'll laugh at you because, man, look at this idiot. He looks all normal and everything, but he cannot even, you know, follow his, you know, his promise. He cannot even follow what even he preaches. Yes, I will address it again publicly. 
as best I can. So again, if you want to address some, a certain thing publicly, no both sides. Try to be fair. You cannot even be fair. You are you can only do on other people. You know, you can never call out your own, including yourself. And I will listen to it in a different manner. I, I will actually really, really listen and not mock and carry on and that kind of thing. In fact, you will probably say that, you know, if someone were to say DV Cisco, you know, forwarding a domain to some porn website, and you will say, where is the evidence? Man, you are pathetic, man. Uh, maybe I misunderstood. There's a couple of things I'd like to mention. What's up, Ryan? But I'll, I'll arrive at those in a moment. You'll be seeing some Bible studies out of me. I've actually got some materials here that I'll be using. You can definitely get the Doctrines of Grace by KFT Matronola. Okay, well, that's GM so. Christian Ghost Doc Book. But you can't have more videos left. Looks like he's going to go have another set against uh, Ryan. But anyway, you guys have fun. Uh, you know, I think this is about it. And uh, if you have a, if you want to have a discussion about this, Bruce, let me know. You know, I'll, I'll, I'll be happy to host, uh, host a hangout for you, and discuss this kind of matter. Okay. And likewise, if you have a problem about like God uh, of the world versus God, for example, or we can actually even discuss about uh, enemy of God versus your enemy, it's kind of thing. You know, what's the difference? And stuff like that. All right. But anyway, have fun with Ryan. Rest of you, thank you for listening. God bless you and have a good one. Bye for now.